hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's your boy mr who with another you know this one is a sad story man but before anything else you may subscribe to my channel you may subscribe like yo have you subscribed to my channel if you have it man and opportunity to subscribe button pick up subscribe you know share pick a comment encouraging banner acha chuki man like acha na chuki like just say something positive about this video and yeah let's help mr who grow so yeah i hope like you know apparently i just hope everyone who may scare the bad news like to me receive like you know as a nation like uh we've lost chris like chris kiruby you know and uh, yeah chris kiruby was among one of the billionaires in kenya and not only in kenya but in africa so what a lot of people don't know about chris is that is like at the um say i'm a girl from a from a family which is very poor and he has managed to actually maneuver through all these hard conditions and be who he was like you know till his you know till his last days so actually uh chris was born in moranga and yeah he lost his parents while he was very young and now like he endal among the like endal kwa mkuba siblings wake so he had to struggle for them and you know be the sole provider as a parent so as he was growing up like you know alikuwa alikuwa na depend on you know well wishes ku 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 party of food and these other things like you know the basic things that a family needs but al grow up kiasi his first job akapata job na shell you all know shell is the petroleum company na alikuwa ile section ya magas alikuwa anuza magas yenda alikuwa mse hapo magas na you know kuzi service and yes miss boy so from hapo chris uh, chris akafanya hapo hivyo like you know from there akaingia kenatco y'all know kenatco uh, kenatco it's a taxi company which is owned by the government like the kenyan government yeah so from kenatco that's when like you know chris akaanza kupata you know akaanza kujoana na wase that's when like akaanza ku make his networking and yeah that's when he started buying property and selling them buying property and reselling and we all know how profitable that business is especially at a time when not a lot of people in that position to have you know like they were not aware of how to secure these things and actually have the financial power to to buy these things so yeah guys up on the chris ali ali and the app ali industry like ali pofika up with us and you know kunini could network now i say and he grew to who he was actually actually munajum say he has a lot of shares in companies like a lot alcohol he has some shares in coca cola uh he also has shares in he owns capital fm and he also owns hako 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 mastude munajua hako ile company ya rula hiyo na other company hako i think like plastics you know pegs and everything those other things this is what like he has shared this company capital fm nimesema pia ni yake yeah So yeah this this journey of you know Chris Kirubi and yeah yeah and you know kume kwa na a lot of you know hate I really don't okay so you come on hate but you know a lot of stories which are not really you know very like you know they cannot be very they're not very credible about where he got his wealth was ingawa anasema like you know different stories but unajua but uh, i'm not really conversant na story yake about you know its wealth and everything but that's the you know the brief story i've given you guys about it and how he started to where he was and all i know like una jo kikwa na kitu like una jo wase lazima abonge wase lazima abonge so i'll not be surprised if most of these stories was you know like propaganda but all i know na tium sale kwa na shares kwa nakumat yal no nakumat uh and uh, he has like he had majority of the shares and once he withdrew his shares the nakumati kanguka and i just feel like one of the reasons why ni ati aliona nakumati nanguka kuna yote time nakumati liko imepiga compare sana na task so ili kuna collapse so i just feel like one of the reasons why ali withdraw you know my pesa zake and everything kwa sababu nakumati was not doing well na ingeenda down with his money anga kwa macho meka sindio yeah So yeah that's the short story of you know okay basically the long and short story of Chris and yeah and that's all you know a lot of people don't know about it like you know he was grew from a you know from a really humble family and you know I'm a fanya philanthropy pia I think I'm say they say in a couple of ways not really specific about that but you know there's some programs amekuwa nazo amekuwa beneficial to the society and all 
anyway all i wanna say is in like you know you're mourning a great person like you know being a billionaire and you know inspiring other people at the same time kwa sababu kuna seka huda amesema mwa inspire to be where they are today and you know we don't take it lightly like you know we don't take it lightly lightly kwa sababu you know we get inspired by people so lazima msia kupatie you know akupatie my handouts directly so lazima nikupatie do like you know whatever i'm doing can inspire you to to be a great person so me i'm celebrating chris for this cause kwa sababu i'm inspired say wengi plus you know he's been a good guy to this nation so yeah guys that's the short story of chris and you know we are mourning him and you know we rest in peace man he's a you know like you know he's a legend I'll, i'll just say he's a legend in my own way because you know of the of the, the things he's managed to accomplish you know in a country like where we don't have a lot of opportunities he he managed to to beat that i'm a vip so yeah guys you know check out more of my videos like you know make sure you subscribe make sure you share to this channel share the good channel of mr who man then it asema marangapi hey share 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 and yeah guys that's what's up stay tuned for more content and that's how we do it kaboom